I've worked in the industry for about 27 years. Uh, I, when I left here, I worked with um, uh, another faculty member here by the name of Malcolm Spall who was a graduate student when I was an undergraduate student here in that first animation class and we made a film called The Walrus and the Carpenter which won a Student Academy Award. Uh, that sort of launched uh, certainly me off into the industry and that's all I've really done since I left RIT was work in the animation industry exclusively. Um, it's a strange industry. It's, uh, I've worked in the entertainment side of it and um, it really took me all over the world. I've worked on Ardman's Creature Comfort series for the British and American market. The feature Coraline I worked on. Uh, years before that I worked on an Ardman film called Chicken Run. Um, and uh, I worked on a Hallmark special a couple of years ago for Bent Images Lab in Portland, Oregon. Worked on a Sony Bravia spot in New York City uh, about four years ago. Uh, so I like to keep active in the industry and uh, it's fun for me, it keeps my, my chops up uh, and it also allows me to see what my colleagues are doing in the in industry and it allows me to uh, continue to make connections for my students here at RIT. Um, oftentimes there may be four or five students who are very interested in stop motion each year that come out of our program uh, and I'm able to give them very uh, personalized uh, mentorship but also to hook them up with studios that are looking for interns both in the East Coast and on the West Coast. Uh, and it's because of my connections in the industry that uh, that's possible. Uh, one of the other great things about working on my own films is that it keeps me um, on my toes. There are a lot of things that, um, that I continually learn from doing my own work um, that I'm able to relate to uh, with the students. Uh, and, and I think that makes me a better teacher. I can howl like a wolf. <laughs> Animation, as you can imagine, can be very tedious and very slow. Some people think I must be incredibly patient. I'm not really patient. I just have a different sense of time. But I have a great passion and love which overrides the inconveniences and what, what can be tedious for some uh, of this art form. There's so much in animation. There's storytelling, there's character performance, there's design, set design, movement, editing, special effects. All those things come together nicely in animation, any technique. Uh, it just so happens I practice stop motion and it's able, it's a, it's a form that it's able to, for me to bring all these different techniques together and keep stimulated and challenged. Um, so there's, there's a lot to it.